first at 10 tonight for the second time in less than a month. An AR-15 stolen out of a wildlife and fisheries truck. Yeah, it happened outside the Academy Sports on County Line Road in Ridgeland. 16 WABT's Jennifer Ortega joins us live with this story. Jennifer, the big question, have they found this gun yet? Nope, still no sign of the weapon. The truck was parked outside of Academy Sports. The officer was inside buying supplies when someone busted the window and stole the officer's AR-15. The thieves managed to steal a AR-15 style 223 semi-automatic rifle. Uh, the gun was in lockdown. However, the thieves were able to compromise it and uh, get away with it. Store managers at Academy Sports weren't able to talk to us. Corporate did tell us they have video of the break in and they're still investigating. And Jennifer, this case sounds so similar to the one just two weeks ago when someone stole a weapon from a wildlife and fisheries truck. That's right. It was the same kind of rifle and handgun that they took two weeks ago from a similar truck. Now, that truck had happened to be at Cabot Lodge in Jackson while an officer was in town for an archery tournament. Officials have not recovered those guns either. Right now, two AR 15s and a handgun stolen from wildlife and fishery officers are still on the streets. In Jackson, Jennifer Ortega, 16, WAPT News. Okay, Jennifer, thanks.